In the previous video, I attempted to use the Shishi Adoshi fountain to start the three quarter inch U siphon, and it was not quite enough flow rate from this volume of water with the ram pump. Then I tried to use the half inch U siphon, and this volume worked, which brings up a issue with using the Shishi Adoshi. What if instead of a two and a half gallon bucket, I was using a 55 gallon drum or bigger, um, this is not gonna be enough volume and I probably can't even make a siphon, I mean a, um, a shishi adoshi big enough in volume to start such a huge tank. That's where I thought of the idea of using a bucket that could be siphoned with this concept into another tank that is bigger. This would have a much higher flow rate and possibly be able to start this. So that's what today's test is going to be about. And this is my last U siphon video for a while. I'm going to be moving on to the bell siphon next. So I hope you enjoy this experiment. Here's the idea. The ram pump will fill up the shishi adoshi, which will then dump into this bucket, which has a half inch U siphon attached to the bottom, which will suck all the water out of here into the bucket we've been testing that has a three quarter inch siphon on it with an exit pipe down there. So hopefully the water that's coming out of the ram pump will be able to start this siphon again, which will then in turn be able to start the bigger siphon. Okay, I think I have a good view for you here. I'm gonna finish filling up the shishi adoshi and see what kind of results we get from here. There we go. Nice. Let's see if it's enough to start this thing. Wasn't enough. All right, take two. I've added another 90 degree elbow here on the half inch U siphon. Here we go. I see some bubbles. That's always a good sign. I don't know, it's not started yet. Well, it is still going. So these are the results that I'm getting. This siphon did start, but it's very slow as you can see. Uh, it is going down, but not nearly enough to get this one going all the way. So I'm just gonna have to say that for now, this test is not going very well. I feel like there's a lot of potential in a setup like this. But before it becomes a Tom and Jerry mousetrap, I think I'm going to stop here. Uh, there was an issue with this siphon starting in the configuration that I've got here. It's still going, the water's down to here, but it's very low flow. Not enough to get the three quarter inch going. If you've got some fun ideas, write them down in the comments below. I'd love to hear them. And after some more testing with the bell siphon, I might uh, come back and do some more with these. So. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.